The command that will be most useful to you is npm help. Anytime you have a question, anytime you're a little bit lost, I recommend typing npm help instead of trying to find an answer on Stack Overflow. So let's break this down what we get. With npm help, uh, we get the usage instructions. It says you just type npm and then a command. And uh, the list of commands that you can type are here. So that's helpful already. We can see everything that we can do in npm. And right below that, there are four additional help commands that you can run for targeted help. I'm going to cover these two momentarily, but in this video, we're going to talk about these npm help commands. First is npm help and a search term. This is great for when you know that npm can do something, but you're not exactly sure how to get the result that you want. Uh, so let's say we want to install something that's extremely common. Let's get help for install. We'll type npm help install. Easy as that. What we get is all of the documentation for the npm install command. So the name, uh, what it does, it installs packages conveniently enough. A synopsis of how to use the command, which is fantastic. This is like a little cheat sheet built in. Aliases, so npm i works as well. And common options. Um, these will come in really handy uh, with more advanced use. And the documentation just goes on in uh, pretty great detail. We can see that we have uh, one of 26 uh, pages here. Now, this view is using an application called Less to uh, allow us to navigate this document. So um, right now I have my cursor, but I've, I'm, I'm out of that like traditional shell look. So right now I'm in the Less program. I can't use my mouse to scroll further down. So if I want to see more, I, I hit the space key. That'll take me to the next page. We can read more instructions on this and space all the way down to the very end. Now that I'm at the very end, how do I get out of this? Well, you can get out just by typing Q for quit. Now we see our terminal again, and we are back in business. I can scroll back up through what I've spaced through or type clear to make that go away. So again, npm help and the term that we want to look up gets us our docs, Q to quit. Now let's say we're not totally sure which command we need to use. We have kind of a foggy idea of what we're looking to do. We don't have to use commands here in npm help. Type npm help and a search term like installing. If npm help can't find an exact match, it'll show you a list of possible matches. Here we can see um, that by running any one of these commands, uh, you will see that term a number of times in the document. In this case, npm help install has a term installing five times. Uh, npm help config uh, has it four times, etc. And then uh, we can just run this command once we've found the thing that we're looking for and get the docs we were after. So again, npm help gets us a list of all the commands we can run and some additional help finding options. One of those is npm help and a search term, Q to quit. And we can even ask npm for help on its own command, super meta. We'll get the same thing, just instructions on how to use npm, Q for quit, and that's it. 